What's going on guys? Uh, my name is Jeremy and I wanted to start this uh, YouTube channel because I look for Corvette content. Excuse the passengers, but I look for Corvette content all the time and it's either super, super crazy builds or, you know, the stereotypical, you know, old man daily content. And I'm not into that. So I want to bring you guys a different flair in the Corvette community, Corvette space. So I was going to take you through a little bit what I have done to this Corvette, you know, just to kind of keep it going. And uh, let's jump right into it. All right, guys, as you can tell, this is your standard base model Corvette. This is a 2009, so it is an LS3 car. Uh, it's got a little bit done to it, which I'm going to go through right now. We'll start right here in the back. Uh, obviously, um, I do have aero. This is from EOS. Uh, front splitter side skirts and rear wing, all from EOS. Um, all of it's just a plastic black color. Uh, I have the ZR1 wheels um, on the back. I'm running the Toyo Proxy R AAA R's. Uh, they are amazing. If you've never had them, I highly recommend getting them. They will dead hook. These auto cars get a lot of hate. This is an automatic. Uh, it's a 3LT model. Uh, I personally love it being an automatic. I think uh, it puts the power down great. Um, I know a lot of these stick shift guys are going to be real mad and butt hurt about this, but I'm into the auto. Moving along to the good stuff, uh, up under the hood. Yeah, it's got a big old blower on it. Um, that is an ANA supercharged, I think it's a T TI model um, blower. Absolutely love it. Got a lot of big plans coming for the car. That's kind of one kind of why I wanted to start this channel. Um, this thing's gonna transform a lot. I'll try my hardest to put in the description everything done to this car. Uh, there's a ton done to it and a lot more to come. Uh, let's get to the exhaust. So this is a Corsa Sport exhaust. Uh, I really wanna get the extremes once I go uh, heads cam package, but I really like the sound of these. They don't drone too bad. Around 60 miles an hour, you'll get a little droning, but I'll give you a clip of how it sounds right here. Hey guys, so like I said, you know, it's not a Z06, it is a base model. Um, I do have ZR1 rear fenders, uh, that's why it looks a little bit wider than your normal base model. But overall, I love these cars. I've been doing a ton of research, trying to figure out everything I can on these cars, how to make it faster, how to make it sound better, drive better. Um, and that's why I wanted to make this. Everybody just puts clips up of the exhaust or, you know, says, here's the dyno day of these cars. I wanna go through the process of what I order, you know, um, the installation of it. There's just a lot of questions out there that I have that I've either, you know, went through a black hole trying to find answers to or sounds to compare what I want. And I think that, you know, I can bring a little bit of light to that uh, with building this car. So I know this is a short one, introduction video, of course. I do have parts coming and we will, go to the next video whenever those parts arrive. I, I really don't want to dull this process down. I want it to be more informative than anything. Um, gonna get a wide band and we can talk a little bit about the differences in wide band and narrow band when we get to the tuning process Process once we get every everything done. All the parts in and everything, we'll get it tuned of course and uh, I'll go through the process of that. Maybe I can get my tuner on here to talk a little bit about you know what goes into a car like this. But 2009 Chevy Corvette, C6, let's get the party started. 